it's way too early to be up. <laughs> I'm currently taking some maternity pictures. I ended up being able to get on the paddleboard eight months pregnant. That is the bomb, 32 weeks this week. I'm currently taking some maternity pictures by myself. I'm on a little trail that's very popular, very safe. But this is the setup I've got going on. I have my camera, my tripod, me, the bump, and then I am taking some photos in this nice little area that is a block part of the trail anyways. So we will see how this goes. I am sitting down to edit these photos and little one is kicking non-stop. Okay, here's an example. There's a before and there is an after. Okay, I don't know why I go ahead and film these at night. I know the video quality is horrible, but I have pregnancy insomnia and I can't sleep anyway, so I thought I would show you some of the final pictures. I just finished editing all of them. I think they're super cute, especially for taking them by myself in the woods. Granted, I'm kind of a photographer. I've done this in the past. I even took my own wedding photos, so it's not crazy new for me, but it was still something that I wanted to get done. I wanted to see if I could have some photos to kind of commemorate the bump, and I will put them in here. I've got these really cute black and white ones here. I was really, really excited to get some that have the good detail of me and the baby. I made sure to include all of my stretch marks, all of the details of the belly, because these are things I want to remember. And also, they're things that are completely normal and beautiful about pregnancy. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise, by the way. Um, I also got these really pretty glowy ones at the end. And then I also got these super cute ones right here where you can just feel how happy I am. They're not perfect, they are not professional, but they were free 99, which is my favorite price of all. And I am in love with them. Anyways, that's all I have to say for tonight. I hope you are sleeping. I'm not currently, but we're gonna try to fix that. Good morning, everybody. It is way too early to be up. Uh, I know it looks light outside, but that's just Colorado in the summertime. It's light at, at like 5 a.m. So don't let that deceive you, but it is early. It's Sunday morning and you know what that means. It is time to go fishing. It has been one of my husband and I's favorite pastimes this summer. It's something I can do with the pregnancy. I just sit in the chair, have a good time, drinks, food, my favorite things. But as you might know, we live in the Rocky Mountains here and today we are going to be venturing up a little further into the mountains and going to a special reservoir just one that's a little further up there so we can get a little more of that rainbow trout and some of the other trout up there um, as well as spend the day in the mountains because it's going to be hot not too hot it's going to be like 85 down here but as you go higher in the mountains and higher in elevation we'll be going from like 6,000 um, feet in elevation to about 8,500 feet in elevation so quite a little bit of a increase 85 to I think 9,000 feet um, it is cleared with my doctor. It's okay for me. I'm a high altitude pregnancy in general, so I'm allowed to go up to elevation that other women who start at lower elevation might not be able to, but it's going to be about 10 degrees cooler, which my pregnant butt loves. I will tell you that right now. That and I can put my toes in the water a little bit, which is going to be nice. I might do some paddle boarding. We'll see. But right now I'm packing up for us to go and then we will be on the road. my breakfast too. Hi. Hi. I'm eating breakfast before I go and I thought I'd share with you because a lot of you are pregnant on here or going to be pregnant. The best quick breakfast for pregnancy. It's not pastries. It's not donuts. Those are going to give you a blood sugar crash. This kind of does, but it 
It fizzles out at a nice rate. It's honey bunches of oats. Okay, obviously it's super processed still and it's not perfect, but out of all the cereals, it has the highest vitamin content I've been able to find. And it's fairly good for the budget too, so I'm not mad at it. Got a little raspberry tea latte to go and we are officially on the road. Ish. We have one more stuff to make, but then we are officially on the road. <laughs> hiking to get over to our spot we have the boys who are in the canoe but I am not going anywhere near that the waves are a little too choppy for me to feel comfortable with that today I'm huffing and puffing like there's no tomorrow but that's the reality of hiking when you are seven eight months pregnant oh my gosh Whew. trying a little bit but it's beautiful out here today I'm really happy to be out here I think have a really good time. Okay, we've been out here for a couple hours. Realizing now I have a fish on the line, or I had a fish on the line and I missed, no, I have a fish on the line. See, this is what happens when you try to record and you don't pay attention. Oh my God. Just got back to the truck. We are heading out because it's getting a little stormy. I'm a little sunburned, definitely eaten up by mosquitoes, but I had a great time. I ended up being able to get on the paddle board, eight months pregnant. I didn't do too well, but it was my first time. So I'm giving myself grace for that as well as, even though I was terrified, I went on the canoe with my husband for a little bit and I had an all around pretty good time. I'm excited to get home and rest. I will say it's kind of wild to me because we're up in the mountains, a little bit in the middle of nowhere. There's actually a cyber truck up here. It's one of my first times seeing one. If you've seen one, you know, they're just like big bulky pieces of metal, but how it got up here, how it's doing so well is beyond my mind. I know they technically work. I know they're technically awesome up here, but it's still just mind blown. Anyhow, that is all for now. I think I got a sunburn. <laughs> I think I got many a sunburn. I also forgot to put sunscreen on here. I got burned a little bit too. Yeah, you just showing off your sunburn. <laughs> I think you're showing off a little more than that. My face doesn't look too bad, but I was gonna try to show the bump, but I can't, because it's like all the way up here. No, because I shrink. Oh. See, this is why you have a bob in your life. Is the bomb 32 weeks this week? Yay! Okay, that's all I needed. <laughs> 